All right, today we are going to show you how to make mushrooms. First things first, you will need freshly cut oak logs. Uh, preferable length would be about three to four feet. Uh, preferred width of the log should be or would be about six inches, but you take what you get or what you can find. So the max uh, um, age of the cut log should be maximum three months. Okay, so this is what we got. We found what we found. It's uh, freshly cut um, oak logs by um, uh, live Southern Live Oak. And we loaded up the trailer with them. Some are um, thinner, some are thicker, but you know, you find what you can find. Uh, so what you will need in order to make mushrooms, okay, so let me show you first what you will need. You will need angle grinder tool. This is how it looks like. You can get it at Harbor Freight Tools. They are uh, inexpensive. Uh, the last time I checked it, they were about um, approximately like $30, $40 or so. They were uh, uh, quite uh, affordable. Then what you will need, you will need sting steel angle grinder adapter, which is this part here. You can also get them in aluminum, but steel will definitely last you longer. Okay. So this is um, this is how it looks like steel angle angle grinder adapter, and then you will need 12 millimeter soft steel drill bit uh, screw tip with screw tip bit with stop. So it's 12 mil millimeter soft steel drill screw tip bit with stop. Okay, this is how that looks like, and you attach it to steel angle grinder adapter all right so this is the tool you will need and you will need it to drill holes the holes that you will drill in your log should be diamond pattern and let me show you here all right they will they will be in diamond pattern all right so you will also need inoculation tool uh, inoculation tool uh, can be uh, a thumb style brass inoculation tool or you can get them in you know made with different materials but this is what you will need to put your um, your mushroom spores uh, your mushroom soda spawn into uh, into logs all right so these are the basic tools you will need and um of course having a chainsaw would also be a very good idea you will also need wax but i will show you that later so augie here will show you how to drill holes into your oak logs make sure you use eye protection at all times Right, so this is how these 12 millimeter holes look like and you will do this in diamond pattern on each log all around the log okay so now augie is going to show us how to put mycelium into holes drilled in oak logs All right, so basically what you do, you fill up your inoculator tool with mycelium and you press it down into the hole that you pre-drilled.
So once all of the holes are filled with mycelium, what you do is you use wax, melted wax, and cover those holes with wax. And that's melted wax. So make sure to cover with wax both sides to prevent moisture, evaporation, and premature drying of the log. And then you cover each hole with wax. This great little puffy tool comes with the, the, uh, with the package from Field and Forest. If you order their mushroom making kit, it comes with a kit. Or you can order it separately from Field and Forest. So if you're looking to place order for different kinds of mushrooms, I would suggest Field and Forest website. They have all kinds of mushrooms and you can also order everything that you need for mushroom making. And once you're done covering all the holes with wax, that's, that's it, you're done. You mark your log with the type of mushroom and date, and that's it. Your mushrooms are on the way. Let me just show you. So we got shiitake mushroom soda spawn from field and forest. It's a little bit windy today. And we continue to heating up wax while we are filling up holes with mycelium. It's good for you. And that's it. These are all the logs that need to be filled. These are pre pre drilled that we prepared them a few weeks ago and now they're ready to be inoculated. All right, you guys, if you have any questions, leave them in the comment section. Please like, share, and subscribe.